Good morning. Where are we going? Are you going to see your grandma and grandpa in New York? Their first plane right along? Oh boy. Do you want to share how upset you are? That there's no Starbucks or McDonald's. For First every time flight. we yeah. have gotten a flight without McDonald's. And Starbucks. So they have a $12 sandwich here. Chris, do you love your $12 sandwich? It tastes like a $2 sandwich from gas station. Yay, we're in New York. Yay, we're in New York. Yay. All right, Ellis flight experience. Um, terrible initially. And then Paw Patrol saved the day. Oh yeah, Paw Patrol <laughs> is so clutch. I think she was just hungry and tired, so as soon as the plane lifted, we fed her and she ate and she slept the entire flight. She woke up right when we landed. She slept through so much noise. Yeah. It's uh, actually surprising. I'm very grateful that she can sleep through anything. We are going to get a lift to the hotel. We're staying at Park Terrace Hotel in Bright Park. All right, so we got the Queen Deluxe room in Park Terrace Hotel in Bryant Park. It's bigger than I thought. Yeah. And then we have a little area here where we can lounge. And they're sweet enough to bring us a uh, Manhattan on the Rocks and popcorn. Let's go to the bathroom. <laughs> yeah. I love this bathroom. It's all marble and white. It's small, but it's not too small. I feel like it's the perfect size. The shower's really nice. And then this door, look, ready? Get out. Oh yeah, feels like an art gallery. <laughs> yeah, that's it for our room tour. So we're here to get coffee first. Have Black Fox coffee, right? Black Fox coffee. I wanted to try their sesame chai. Mm. It's really good. Oh, that's what the sesame is. It's kind of nutty, and then it's like cinnamony. It tastes like fall. Kind of reminds me of Korean drink. Thank you, appreciate it. Which Korean drink? <laughs> I don't know what it's called. <laughs> Ew, don't eat it. Hello. Hello, wait. Say hi. Touristy. Want a hot cocoa? And a pot of chocolate. We have it in Paris. Oh. It's a hot cocoa place I told Angie to go to. Oh my god. My pot of chocolate is really good. And then this is like out of this world. Kind of reminds me of like the Spanish hot chocolates. Mm. It's like a thinner version of that. So good. It's the best hot chocolate I've ever had. I can see why people lined up in Paris. For it. I feel like that's how you know you're in tight square. I think I agree with Kevin. If it was by our house, I think it is my movie. But I feel for New York bagel, I don't know if it's the best. I think I like a sub bagel more. Just meat and cheese. The meat is so good. Instead. So Grace thought that we would not have anything to do this afternoon and yet here we are eating our what? This is our fifth meal? I don't know, I lost track. No. I don't feel that full though. And yet we're supposed to have dinner still? Yeah. And I have a lot I want to order for dinner. Oh great. <laughs> I hope it's as good as I remember it to be. That's good. I don't know if I had the same reaction as you, but it's good. Wow. So after our never ending relay race of just eating food, <laughs> we took a break and now we're back at it again.
Okay, so what do we have? So this is the, the beef tartare called you you can and then this is a complimentary salad. I already drank most of my mission cocktail and then this one is the fried soft shell crab. Mm. These are all recommendations by my cousin and it's so far so good. Chris, what's this one? Really good. <laughs> I think this is my favorite thing place to eat that in Walking thoughts. Yeah, it's yeah. nice. Yeah, this is a. Uh... Like this is what's relaxing for me. You know, not just sitting on a beach. I can't do that. That like walking in the city at night is what relaxes me mm -hmm. more than sitting out and sunbathing. I agree. Right? It's been since 2019 that I was yeah. here. Do you love it? I wouldn't ever say that I've missed the city, but I, oh, I always miss the city. I didn't think I realized how nice yeah. the city can be. Oh. Speaking of which, Jay walking. I think compared to the other big cities that we've been to, yeah. SF, Boston, Chicago, yeah, there's some, yeah, there's everything just dead at this After hour. After like eight, yeah. Yeah, I think there's still some, something really nice to be said about New York in that aspect. Mm -hmm. So today's day two, we're starting off with Lafayette Grand Cafe and Bakery. This was kind of like tiktok -y nice. That's where I saw it. And then Hannity said it's really good too, so I wanted to try it out. Mmm. Really good. Oh wait, I didn't get to the middle. Mm. Kind of tastes like a... Mixed between a ganache and a chocolate pudding on the inside. And the croissant is very crispy and flaky all throughout. The Gracie is in there getting uh, coffee at La Pabra. The uh, line is kind of crazy, so just waiting her for her to come out. Ella, I think your mama is lost in the coffee world. She's taking forever. or on her own. Ella, your mama has returned. It has been 5,000 years that she's so been long. in La Cabra. So long, so busy. <clears throat> Their cold was good. You see this? Ta -da. This is popular there. It's called the rye tart. That was so good. Yeah. Uh, I love those pizza. I haven't Great. had New York pizza in like three years. Silence. So good. It was so good. Always so good. thin, crispy, so not crispy. soggy. Sauce is and perfect. Then and then the cheese is so cheesy. Oh yeah. <laughs> you know it's good when we're eating pizza and we just, it's silent. We don't yeah, say anything. Yeah, we literally <laughs> said nothing. Uh, you 
tofu here. It's a yumi kebab place, which is tofu skin, stuff like rice. This place does toppings. I'm so tired. Which one's which? That's the Myeongnang, which is fish roe. This one is cheu, pork. And that one is tuna mayo, spicy mayo. This is like, you know the thing we had yesterday, Kevin? The dur the torso? And it had cream in it, it's this. It's a little more mayo. And the rice is a little more like rice cake. But I like the flavor. This is the pork. I like that one. It tastes very Korean. Spicy tuna. Spicy mayo tuna. Mm. Oh, she's squirming so much. It's hard to film. Look at her. That's why. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Oopsie. There you go. <laughs> it was okay. I don't know if it's something you have to get, but if you want something Asian, you need something quick, then it's a good idea. Alright, so we spent the rest of the morning just going around Soho. We're gonna grab some yeah. salads for Ella, the Whole Foods, and then meet up with the parental. Yeah, try that, and then we'll head back to the hotel after. Ooh, 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 ooh. Baby, 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 baby. <laughs> She kept smiling. Yeah, she's very smiling. Yeah. Hi, we're at Nubiani for dinner. This is our last night here in New York. And we are at dinner with Kevin's sister and boyfriend. So let's go eat. Tell me I'm the one you want. Tell me I'm the reason your heart beats and it won't stop. Yeah. But I'd rather have this, you know? So yeah, I highly recommend it. So, Chris, you want to talk about why we're at the Apple store? Um, so, I left my phone on the Uber and I took it back and stole it. So now I have no phone. So now we have to buy a new phone. So we're at Grand Central Market. But hey, I've never been here and it's really cool. <laughs> yeah, and so, it's why, why aren't you grabbing her face now? There we go. There's the Ella that we know. Rare okay. Her steak, medium rare. No, 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 no.